If anybody ever gave you advice about traveling overseas, you shouldn't be me. It's vlogging at 830. <laughs> Good morning. Today is supposed to be bed day. I hope it's bed day. <laughs> I gotta clean out the last of this stuff. I don't have a lot of stuff in here that I need to clean out. I'm kind of worried they're gonna complain that the couch is here, but oh well. I mean, they've gotta end up building beds around some weird stuff. But I'm going to, I gotta get the desk out of here and that means I gotta clean up. I, I just, I need to clean up a little bit. I need to sweep. I also need to do laundry so that I can get my laundry organized later. I'm really looking forward to getting everything actually organized in the way that I'm imagining and also seeing what I have to work with to get the rest of my stuff organized. It's kind of nerdy, I know. I'm my mother's son. She used to be a professional organizer, so, you know, I may not always appear that organized, but I do enjoy the process of getting organized. As long as it doesn't involve, like, actually going through my own mail. I don't like going through, especially junk mail. Anyways, I'm gonna clear this all up after I get my laundry started. That's my plan. Hopefully that doesn't backfire because hopefully they're not here that quickly. They should be here in three hours. Should be enough time to go start my laundry, get some coffee, clean this up, finish laundry, finish cleaning, then they show up. And then we'll see what we can show. Hopefully I can actually fit in here and film a little bit while they're building the bed. I really don't know. And then we'll just go from there. Sounds good? Let's go. Yeah. They're a great way to break a 20 so you can do laundry. Yeah, I did that. Mmm, need that real bad, mm, it's delicious. They sell coffee from the barn, which is in Berlin, which is where I'm gonna be going soon, which maybe we'll see, I don't know. I'm getting really excited apparently, just from the tone of my voice. Anyways, I also got a pan of chocolate because, you know, life's short, pastries. Uh, that said, it's time to go back and uh, get some cleaning done and moving, not a lot of moving, mostly cleaning. I have a cup full of these somewhere. These are useless, just useless coins. And what's really annoying is, so you can use the automated machines to pay with these, but if you don't get the exact amount, it'll take revenge on you and give you like another amount of change in just this. Nobody wants these copper coins. Why do we still have them? Everybody hates these. They, like stores won't take them. Most machines won't take them. When I say automated machines, I mean at the grocery store, those ones will take them. But like the laundry machine, others, you can't use them in like 90, 95% of uh, financial transactions, so. Why? Why? Now, don't judge me too harshly, but I think I'm gonna end up having McDonald's again today. The reason being, not that I really want McDonald's, but I'm again in a rush, and more importantly, they offered me a free meal. I offered, I mean, I, I won it in the Monopoly game, so, you know, I want a free meal. I'm kind of in a hurry. If they don't redeem it for whatever reason, I don't, I mean, we'll see if it works, but if they don't redeem it, I'll just get a sandwich down the street. Sounds good. Nope, you can't use them until next month. Which means probably I'll never use it because I'm gonna lose it long before that. Which is fine, because really, you shouldn't eat McDonald's very often. It's not good for you. I'm gonna walk over to one of my favorite little bakeries. It's got some delicious sandwiches. Grab one of those really quickly, hopefully, and then grab my laundry and then go home, eat it. And hopefully, <laughs> we're ready for bedtime. Got here right as it finished.
I've been keeping my clothes in here, you know, for the last couple of months since I got rid of the, uh, or longer, ever since I got rid of the dresser. So it's been a while. Normally I fold them, but I don't have time right now and I'm gonna be moving them out of here and moving this thing hopefully downstairs shortly. So, I mean, don't judge me too harshly. Normally I would fold this, normally. They are here basically on time. I'm wiping the windows down a little bit. I can't reach all the way up there to clean them, but at least I can get a little bit clean. And maybe with my bed, I'll be able to clean higher, but they're here, which is exciting. The only problem is I have electricity and my internet right where the stairs are supposed to go. I'm not, I was hoping they could cut like a hole in the little stairs. It's not gonna do that. I'm not sure how I feel about this. This, we already, that's losing. We're gonna lose like that much space, which doesn't sound like much, but in the grand scheme of things, that's a lot of space to lose in here. So see how this goes. <laughs> I can hear them rolling stuff out there. Sounds like thunder, let's go check it out. Oh wow. Il y a un peu de lit là. Un petit peu. The frame is up. He's building the top pieces, I think, right now. And out here, the stairs. Are being unpacked. And I got a lot of cleaning done. I just scrubbed the whole shower down. I just, I'm out of paper towels, though, sadly. So, sponge can only do so much. up with a compromise where we actually moved the front one's supposed to be able to pull out but because it's solid on the side we couldn't move it all the way like over the plugs so we actually swapped it out with one that has a hollow side and we were able to push it in over that put the one with the drawer on the inside don't know if i'm ever going to be able to really use that drawer because i think the couch is going to be in front of it but everything should be a little bit closer to the wall this way so i'm less likely to shove my foot down inside of him when in the middle of the night Yeah, I need a vacuum cleaner. There are gonna be some problems with the electricity and internet. Hopefully, I was hoping that I'd be able to snake it through the other side, but they're solid on the back end, so it's gonna require a little bit of drilling later to make holes, but uh, we'll worry about that when we get back from Berlin. Voila. This is the this is the new reality. Look at this. It's perfect. I can walk under here. I won't hit my head. This is it's like ah, uh, it's, it's so good. The couch fits. We have enough space to pull out the drawers and the desk. This is awesome. 
I don't know how to proceed from, oh wow, I really should have cleaned those windows earlier. That looks a lot better. And I can still open the windows really far. This overall, you wanna go upstairs? We should go upstairs. I just need to take off my shoes. Ow. Look at this, not so bad. Put a mattress in here Ow. and I'll almost be able to like be on my knees like this. Just gotta watch your head. This thing is rated to hold over 400 kilograms, so I'm feeling pretty good about it. And I'll be able to do pull-ups on the frame as I go, which is not something most of you are concerned with, but I definitely need to do some exercise. And this is a completely different angle on the courtyard from up here. I like it. I'm really excited. I'm really excited. There are a couple of small problems we're gonna have to overcome when I get back from the States. That's not a problem. I mean, they are problems, that's what I just said, that we'll have to overcome, but you know what I mean? It's not an issue. We'll, we'll figure it out, it won't, be, it won't be bad. I'm going to move a minimal amount of stuff in here right now, but after all that, I'm feeling I just need to sit down for a minute, I need to rest for half a second. And I helped them a lot, as much as I could. I carried a bunch of stuff, I unboxed stuff, I cleaned, I'm, def I'm definitely hungry. Okay, let's go. Oh, yeah. I mean, I don't have a mattress yet, but there is plenty of space up here to lie around and not worry about it. This is pretty great. It's gonna be cozy. Oh, good. And there is, there's a, there's a plug up here with me. It's important because I thought that they were just put, there's a plug here and one on the underside of the upstairs so I can plug stuff in. I'm gonna put my Google Home on the shelf downstairs and listen to some music and have a snack. And then uh, I still gotta sleep downstairs because I've got good news about the mattress as well. It's not 100% confirmed, but don't worry, I won't be sleeping on these blank wood slats for long. They did break one of my Perry Street. I, I, I gave them water. He just broke it and spilled all, literally all the water on the, on the floor and some of it on my couch. But aside from that, this went pretty smoothly. I gotta, I gotta buy a vacuum eventually. Bang it. Moment of truth. Will the chair fit so that I can, you know, like edit my vlog and work and stuff? Yes, it does. I didn't even have to move this over a little bit, which I might do later. That's good. So it turns out, all right. Obviously I'm a little bit too excited to uh, get straight to the relaxing part. I'll relax in a second. I know a lot, this has been a long day for everybody. Mostly for me, you guys are hopefully having a great time. I'm actually having a wonderful time. I'm very excited. I just can't wait to get rid of that chair. Like I said, there are a couple of issues to deal with, to figure out. It's cool, the storage is really cool. A lot of it's inaccessible because of the couch, but I knew that would be the case. What I'm really excited about is that all my measurements panned out. This is all conceptual and it looks like we are like on point. This is amazing. Hmm, how are we gonna get, we're gonna have some, can this lift? Ever so slightly. So we're gonna have a couple of issues getting the carpet in here, but that's okay. This space feels delightful, cozy. It's actually happening, this is good. This is really, really good. Can you, I hope I'm not too backlit. The, only, the other thing is we definitely need to get lights in here. I'm really glad that that is part of the chateau process. So I'm looking forward to putting some lights in here and then we'll be good to go. It, it's funny because when you actually get this thing put together like this, it feels a little less wide than expected because in my head, I have more space in here than I really have, but it fits exactly what I measured. So it's, a, it's, it's, it's pretty much perfect. I'm, I'm, I'm good and I love the color, this like deep mahogany, mm, so classy. I'm gonna leave things here. I will show you how I decide to organize things. I will see you bright and early tomorrow morning for a little bit more organizational stuff here and a cheese thing tomorrow night, assuming that my invitation is still good. Go to a cheese thing. Cheese is always good. And hopefully this place is gonna come together really quickly now that the key components are here. Oh yeah, I didn't plug in, I didn't plug in the Google Home. And now I leave you. Have a nice day, I'll see you tomorrow. Adios. She's alive.